All right, come over, bitch. Oh shit, I'm hitting on a titty. Oh, get fucked. Sea of Thieves in 2022. This is a game I somehow missed when it first came out, mostly because I had no guys keen on playing it with me and it seemed like a pretty shit solo experience, but release of season six, figured why the hell not. So let's pick up some bounties and just jump right into it. Okay, so we got a McDonald's chicken nugget. Okay, then we got sideways chicken nugget. Oh, it's right there. Sweet. Alright, let's do this. Okay, so we want to slingshot around Thieves Haven. This <laughs> we're going to Booty Isle. It's uh, clearly a McDonald's chicken nugget, but okay. Uh, right in the center. And yep, this is this side. Alright. So from that rock, it's up the path, just for the end of it, and that guy's pissed off, alright. He looks special, I feel like I should kill him. Riveting gameplay, okay. As things kind of go, I was finding like the start pretty, like pretty relaxing. Like the moment to moment gameplay wasn't bad. I mean, digging up chests like this got kind of repetitive. Okay, pretty damn repetitive. But like the scenery is nice, just controlling your ship is pretty sweet. And it's just a general nice vibe, just kind of cruising around, you know? To the skull summoning totem on the southeast outer ring. Okay, well, we're on the southeast side, so. They will not find a painted stingray on the south inner ring, Captain Skull. But should you hop. But should you do hold lantern a lot uh, on the south inner ring? Where's my boat? Oh, actually, okay, this this probably is the south, the southern one, so maybe it's on this side. There it is, okay. Find a painted gra crab on the northeast inner ring. A road to Fortune with Shovel's Blade, six paces east, okay. So what was it, northeastern? So this is south, so it should be maybe not this one, but over there. What was that? A painted crab. Okay. Uh, oh, painted crab, okay. Uh so that's so six paces east. One, two, three, four, five, six. Incredible. What a game. Okay, I, it's getting me now. It's getting me now. There we are. Is that 
that sounds like it could be skeletons. <laughs> Boy. Now obviously this gameplay loop wasn't like the whole game. This isn't it. It's not just literally digging up chests. This was just kind of the early stuff that I could do. I feel like the rest of it you kind of need more people from what I was seeing online. Um, I did try, I do try multiplayer later and that, that's an experience. Hold the banana, dude. What are you doing? What? Get out of here. Yep. That first time every there's skeletons again. There's a ship back there looking at me. Are they coming? Please don't be coming. Oh, I didn't hit anything, did I? No. Oh my god, there they are. looking for me? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, I can confirm they are looking for me. What's up, boys? Hello, fine gentlemen. Going up. See you later. Go fuck yourself. Shoot at me, you piece of shit. Okay, they seem to be going away. So where is the thing on this? Oh, it's this end. It's like right here. Okay. So at this point I was starting to rack up like a pretty, pretty nice amount of loot. Well, I don't know if that's actually good or not. Probably not in the grand scheme of the game, but I was feeling pretty good. I had quite a few chests, a couple of skulls. I had been chased by those guys. I wanted to try and fight them, but I felt like in a small ship on my own kind of zero like coming experience, this way. it was just going to be an absolute cluster. But... At That's this point, I'm seeing ships right. everywhere. I'm starting to get nervous. I'm starting to just want to get out of there with my loot. But I, I had to get this last chest. You know, you can't leave. You can't nah, leave a chest behind. <laughs> you know, you just can't. Yeah, no, that's that's going away. We're good. We're good. Yep, they are coming. But I want that chest. No, no, please. Please, <laughs> don't do this. <laughs> no, please, fuck off. I don't want this. Get out of here, you scoundrels. Come on. Leave me alone. Let's see you fucking make a handbrake turn. Okay, this walk really wasn't very quick.
How, how did you get on here? Get out of here. Pretty sure he threw out like a racial slur as he went down, so I kind of just cut that out, you know. The old shit was pretty railed at this point, but like I was, I was quite, in, I'm quite impressed by how well like the naval combat feels. I'm not good at it. Dear lord, am I bad at it? I couldn't hit shots to save my life during that little encounter, but like. I enjoy the damage aspect of this, how like your ship will sink, and this isn't like new to me, I knew the game involved with this kind of stuff. But it like, it seemed much more, I don't know what the word is, natural, I suppose, you know, you actually have to think about it, you have to get in there. Definitely be easier with two people, again, this is where like the solo player kind of sucks, because if that guy hadn't tried to board me and died heroically, uh, or maybe not heroically if it was a racial slur, but you guys won't know that. Um, like, if you had two people, it'd be great to have somebody at least still steering the boat, because I had no clue where I was going right now. Absolutely no clue. I was just praying at this point in time that I wasn't going to run into a, just some kind of island or giant rock or anything. And I was just hoping I was going in a straight line. <laughs> I had no clue if I'd left myself in a straight line or not. I'm taking on water. No, still got all my loot. Nice. Okay, we're going straight at the outpost. I don't know what these mean. Oh god, are they coming at me? Shit. Motherfuckers, leave me alone! Alright, fuck that one. Where are we going? I guess we're on Sanctuary Outpost. They are trying. Oh my god, they are still coming. You can't be serious, what? Noticing that the sun was going down, I was kind of feeling like I could get away. I was a bit worried because, like, I don't know how to sail very well in this game. You probably noticed my sail is, like, completely against the wind half the time. Not right now, though. Very impressive. But I figured with these rocks here, with the darkness kind of setting in, it becoming nighttime, I was like, yep, easy, into the rocks. Nighttime, I'll kind of hide behind there for a minute. Obviously, once it hit night, I kind of realized I was lit up like a goddamn beacon with all the lights on. I don't know why you'd ever want them on, but who knows? I guess if you're maybe teaming up with other ships, you can see each other. But it was just it was just making me a beacon. Absolutely a beacon. And prime example of that right here. Look at this ship. You can see that from a goddamn mile away. But at this point, I was feeling pretty confident, lost the tail, I just wanted to turn around, got myself back to the Sanctuary Outpost, and you know what? Didn't lose the loot. If I'd lost that, holy hell, that would have been the most depressing thing to happen. But we made it. Made it with absolutely everything, and then we get to do a sweet selling montage. After spending so long, like, just collecting chests and running away from people, I decided I want to try and get a bit risky. I'm going to hide behind that rock. And I'm going to heist these motherfuckers. 
I don't think it's gonna work, but holy shit if I can do it. What was that? Oh no. Is there anything I can do about this? Jesus fucking Christ. Oh, wait. Stop. This old Kraken kind of ruined the old stealth approach, you know? Get off! I don't know if this even does anything. I was not feeling confident they didn't have this one. It was just consistently just smacking my boat and it felt like I was tickling the goddamn thing. Just tickling tentacles and it was just absolutely poking holes in everything it could. I have nothing to repair that with though. At this point, I just had no faith at all. I was going to keep this boat going. I had no wood. I think I ran. I think I ran out of cannonballs or close to. And like, I, I just, I, I think there was a fort nearby that I could go to. I was looking at that, and I was just like, how is that going to work? Um, I also don't understand how I beat the kraken. I don't know if it's like a timed event as well, and like, as long as you just survive it, you'll be okay. Um, but I was feeling pretty damn cool. Not necessarily because I thought I did well, but I made it through. Luckily I noticed some of those just like floating barrels nearby and I knew you could get wood out of them. So I was just like praying as I looked out these uh, the window, <laughs> I could see it again. than I expected. Just take me back.
Oh, that ain't the clutchest save. I don't know what is. We did it. We beat the Kraken. We saved the boat. Holy shit. Thank you for anyone who stuck through till now. Uh, if I could ask you to like and subscribe, it would help. I'm going to jump into doing more YouTube and yeah, it'd be appreciated. So that was the end of my solo adventure. It was pretty damn fun. Like, I'm definitely going to be playing more Sea of Thieves and trying to bait some friends into playing it with me. I did try playing some multiplayer and I'm going to throw some clips of those here at the end. Um, it, look, it was, it was really, uh, what's the word? Unsatisfying. I'd get into lobbies, people would leave like almost immediately or not long later. Not many people had a mic from kind of what I experienced in the brief that I played. Um, but yeah, look, guys. I'll throw some clips in. Don't have mics? No? God damn, dude, I've only just joined the crew and somebody's already left. How are we going, man? I'm guessing things aren't going particularly well. Ah, oh, there you are. Right, just us, hey? Just us, looks like, buddy. to play with people fuck's sake um jesus christ all right so the play together aspect of this game is not is not fucking going particularly well okay one more time hey let's give it one more shot <laughs> it's it's win pvp it's the same guy welcome back motherfucker you thought you could drop me hey win vp how you going, man? I thought you'd seen the last of me, hey, buddy. <laughs> Classic. We've been here two minutes. We haven't even got on the boat yet. We're all standing on the dock, dicking around, and somebody's already left. This was, this is like the third, this was the third time I'd matched up trying. I decided to try it one more time after getting some brand new drip, because my guy's looking fine. But like, it was just every every match, people left within the first like, couple of minutes, I don't know why. Maybe it was because of me, because I always seem to be the only one with a mic in each, <laughs> each game. <laughs> I don't know if me asking the question if people had a mic was putting them off. <laughs> How are we going boys? Do we have... ...the ability to speak? I mean, I'm guessing you don't, you got no- oh, okay. Gonna take that as a, as a solid no then, hey? Ah, no worries. <laughs> yeah, all, all good, man, all good. What the fuck happened to the ship? Here it is again. I'd spawned, hadn't even got to the ship yet, and somebody's already out. How did this happen? How did this happen, Xanax? Oh my god, there's so many holes on the ship. <laughs> I see this ship had seen some, like, pretty solid use before I showed up. <laughs> Yeah, like how did it how did it get that on fire? What the fuck happened? Well, we suddenly have this real pimp ship. Is this yours? Ah, nice. <laughs> Might be a bit difficult for the two of us, but I think we can do it. I like that you have an outfit specifically for like the aesthetic of your ship. Well, I haven't tried much of the of the old multiplayer, but it always seems to turn out this way. Either you get 
no one in your crew, or the crew just kind of falls apart very quickly. Is it always like this? Okay, well that's good. Maybe I've just had some bad luck. <laughs> I thought you were getting a phone call. <laughs> This, this multiplayer experience is 10 out of 10 compared to what I'm used to. Oh. Who needs to be a pirate when you can just be a DJ, right? But yeah, when that music started off, it sounded like the um the classic like da 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 da. Like I, don't, I that probably didn't sell it too well, but that just that cell phone ringtone that everyone knows. Oh, <laughs> not where I expected that that uh that sentence to go, man. Yeah, that that was that was a vibe, but um, true. Yeah, I I would that would have been the last thing I would have taken um taken a guess on was suicide. You know what I mean? What? <laughs> You're not wrong. You are not wrong. What what game am I playing right now? This is okay. It's been real nice hanging out with you, my man, and uh, discussing Japanese um, music uh, genres. Uh, I don't know if you would consider Japanese suicide music genre, but you know, um, I think I'm going to head out. But uh, you have a great day or night, whatever. And uh, hopefully you find a, uh, yeah, hopefully you find a crew at some point. Yeah, so that about wraps it up. I mean, look, as a solo player... It's going to be hard to find a decent crew in this, unless you know people or you manage to get lucky and find people who have mics. I've had a couple of people through it. Obviously, the people who attacked me in their boats, they had mics. I don't know if that's because they were crews and organized crews playing together. I think that's part of the problem, is if you go in just on your own, hoping to find a group of people who are going to be organized, it's just going to be a nightmare. It's just going to be an absolute nightmare. But look, the game's fun, for sure. Like, as a soul player, it's a bit difficult, but I still had a great time. I, I think you'd struggle in the sea combat, but I don't know. If you're not bothered by that, it's definitely worth a shot. Well, look, if you made it this far in the video, thank you so much. Um, if you could throw a like and subscribe on, I'd really appreciate it. And um, yeah, look, have you played this? What do you think about it? Because I'm really enjoying it. Um, it's rough as a solo player, but hell, it's a lot of fun and looks damn good.